Hi, I'm Ria Sidi, live here at Area XO. Drones, robotics, autonomous vehicles. Ottawa is on the leading edge of these technologies. We're so excited to be here, so let's go check it out. We're at the demonstration zone at area.xo featuring 70 plus amazing companies across seven zones from drones, robotics, and everything in between. We're excited to meet everyone here. They're on the leading edge of technology in Ottawa. Let's go talk to them. Michael, Area.xo is an amazing event. Tell me all about what people have to look forward to here. Today is going to be our best event ever. We have over 1,200 people coming here to see almost 80 exhibitors from across Canada. These are all exhibitors that in some way are connected into next generation mobility and cybersecurity scenarios, specifically in solving the world's most wicked problems. So what you'll see here is a bunch of tech but it almost becomes invisible when you look at what that tech is doing because the tech is solving real problems. That's what I get excited about when I come here every day. It just is so uh, accelerated when you come to an event where you've got 1,200 people that are just leaned right in, almost having a Jetsons moment when they're here. What makes Ottawa such a great place for being a leader in this technology? Oh, great question. So the bottom line is, there's really three main industries in this city. It's government, it's tech, and our next one is tourism because we're a capital city and we've got just tons of stuff to see. Because we've got tech and we've got government here, we've got the regulators here, we've got incredible academia. These are the ingredients for what I'll describe as a triple helix model. If you want to move a market, bringing the applied research from academia, uh, bringing together the regulators to do policy hacking on the next big thing for society and then sprinkling in the highest density tech community in all of North America, big things happen. TC Expo serves as a great outlet to showcase a lot of our solutions, especially in a great outdoor environment. There's so many indoor events. Um, our solutions are best used in difficult and demanding conditions. So being able to be out here on such a beautiful day, showing off the, the capabilities in, in different conditions here at DART, different environments, uh, it's a once a year opportunity for us. Um, great chance for our clients to come out and see these things in action, but also for the public to become a little more knowledgeable about some of the great developments in technology this past year and uh, for years to come. At Indra Robotics and at events like these, I'm really looking to connect with the research and development community, people who have innovative ideas in both drones and ground, ground robotics. They don't really know how to bring it to life. That's what we're trying to do here. That's what this is all about. Steve, you're here for your second year at area.xo. Tell me what led you to return and what you're doing here this year. Yeah, thank you. It's great to be here. Last year we came uh, as an attendee, um, so we saw all the great technology that all the companies were working on. Um, this year we, we have the booth as well because we were fortunate enough to receive an ISC uh, contract for the Condor, which we're currently going through testing. Um, so we felt it was a great to, opportunity for us to show our technology and to explain people what, what the capabilities are and what we offer. This episode was made possible by our great sponsors. Tech companies must move at the speed of light, and they need a law firm that moves just as fast. Curly Robertson Hill & McDougall has developed long-standing expertise in helping tech companies address their legal matters. As Ottawa's largest premier full-service law firm, Curly Robertson Hill & McDougall has provided a number of specialized legal services for the past 50 years. Curly Robertson Hill & McDougall's in-house legal experts can help tech companies with financing strategies, venture capital, private placements and public offerings, mergers and acquisitions, intellectual property protections, shareholder agreements, and much more. 
To learn more about how Pearlie Robertson Hill and McDougall can help your company, visit perlaw.ca. I'm here with Sonia Shori, VP of Strategy at Invest Ottawa. Sonia, tell me about some of the desired outcomes here for Invest Ottawa. We are so excited to host TC Expo, this epic national smart mobility tech demonstration day with Transport Canada, ISED, D&D, NGEN, the Advanced Manufacturing Supercluster, uh, and of course FedDev Ontario. And we are all about enabling and accelerating smart mobility, R&D, validation, and future adoption safely and securely. So today, at this, at this demonstration day, we really want to create new opportunities for the founders, the innovators, and the companies that are here in the capital and coast to coast that are demonstrating all kinds of technologies for different sectors from telecommunications to intelligent transportation, smart farming, defense, public safety. It's a very, very wide reach and bringing them together today with a host of prospective customers, employees, R&D and business partners, investors, the ability to showcase technology that works to get people excited to build that momentum and to broker that new relationship, that plants important seeds that downstream drive business, drive economic and commercial outcomes, drive new employment, new jobs. That's what today is all about. What should attendees be most excited about with this event? Uh, so in the ag space today, uh, the last three years of research, we've been able to show a 85% uh, reduction in greenhouse gas emissions by changing how we apply fertilizer to our soil. Um, we have a autonomous mixing station for sprayers that really helps to put all of the right amounts of chemical in the machine uh, without any impact to the farmer. Uh, we have the first aftermarket level five autonomous tractor in Canada. It was launched uh, by our, our company five, about five weeks ago. Uh, it is a Sabanto Ag, and uh, this is our tractor, uh, Deacon. No, there are super exciting technologies. There are drones, there are testing facilities. And, and we present a crucial part because we process uh, um, sensors with our AI algorithms in order to augment their functionality and get more benefits from the data that we get with them. We deploy this, this technology on uh, automotive platforms and infrastructure such as intersections. Techopia is brought to you by many great sponsors, such as EY, building a better working world. Number Crunch, offering virtual CFO services for SaaS companies. Pearlie Robertson, Hill & McDougall, a leader in business and technology sector law. TD Bank, specialized programs for technology companies. The University of Ottawa Faculty of Engineering, creating the next generation of technical talent. Techopia is not only a podcast, we post new articles daily at obj.ca slash techopia. And if you're on YouTube, please subscribe and click the bell icon. It's clear from my conversations today that Ottawa's tech sector is flourishing. There's so much momentum here in drones, autonomous vehicles, agri-tech. It was very exciting and we're looking forward to seeing you next time at the next Techopia event. Thank you very much.